A warm welcome. Blue is the colour. Football is the game, as the old song used to go. We're here at Stamford Bridge tonight in West London. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Germany up against Aston Villa. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer between the posts. Niklas Zule starts with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Serge Gnabry starts with Leroy Zane in the wide positions. And the focal point in attack today, Timo Werner. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Hoping for plenty of excitement here at Stamford Bridge. Well, they know they need to stop him. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Real chance. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. One nil then. Havertz, he's in behind. Oh, not to be. That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. <laughs> An authoritative challenge. Joshua Kimmich. Kimmich. Gnabry with it. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in Tyrone Mings and taken away he won the ball Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending.
Well, a second goal for them here. He's in with a chance. Still alive. Well, a good tackle. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Emiliano Buendia. McGinn. The crossbar got in the way. Well, I'm still amazed that stayed out. He looked to have done everything right, didn't he? Goretzka. Kai Havertz. Werner. Leon Goretzka. Havertz. Can he convert? A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition, John! Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And on with the action. Germany really beginning to flex their muscles. The scoreline threatening to get ugly here. Really good challenge. Timo Werner. And snuffing out the danger. And Kai Havertz. Is it going to be Zane? Another goal! Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Serge Gnabry. Gnabry. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. He's trying to create something. Have to say, a poor touch. Unable to keep it in play. Goal kick. Esri Konsa. Douglas Luiz. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Can they keep it going? And he's through here. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Keep it. Well, the stats confirm that Germany have had the lion's share of possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Ings. Ings. 
they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Havertz. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Kai Havertz. Defensive efficiency personified. Werner. Timo Werner, oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals, no let up here. Well, let's see this again, he tries to run out with the ball, he has the ball taken off of him, he's made the wrong decision, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net, terrible defending. Well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they can add. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. And Kimmich! And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form! Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. Havertz. And they need to get to... Oh, it was a chance! And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Joshua <laughs> Kimmich with the corner did his job defensively and the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge as anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway Serge Gnabry and Havertz and dispossessed McGinn can he find the net determined defending great strong tackle throw in forthcoming Good tackle, take it away. He's in here. Can he finish? And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Good tackle. Kai Havertz. Gnabry. Might be a chance here. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating.
Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Couldn't hang on to it. Havertz. And he's made headway. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly. He gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Possession. And the ball lost here. Sané. And return to Havertz. In with a chance. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it all leads to a very tidy finish. He just guided it with great technique into the net. It's a really good goal. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. An advantage with them. Referee says play on. Kimmy. Oh, what an opportunity. Not an attempt that will live long in the memory. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. And he's got the beating of his opponent. He's blocked it. For more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. And in with a real chance. And I think the less said about that, the better. Well, he went for placement, but that missed by a fair distance in the end. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Well, the advantage wasn't helping them, and so now they get the free kick. Possession one. This is looking threatening. And he might be through here. He went for placement, but not to be. Well, that's a big miss. 1v1 against the keeper, and he's missed the target. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Wonderful tackle. Werner, chances on. On his own with only the keeper to beat, but he's missed it, Stuart. Well, he went for power, but he didn't make the perfect connection. That's why he's missed the target there. Werner. And possession lost by Germany. McGinn. Tremendous challenge. 
And the counter looks on here. Options available. And he's made headway. A goal! He's dispatched it. Much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now might be a chance here. It's opened up for him. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Well, he likes to run at them, but they dealt with the threat posed. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Could be a chance to break here. takes it away well, that piece of play very easy on the eye and he scored not once but twice they simply cannot stop him and no wonder he's enjoying himself well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and the movement is good making for a comfortable finish it's a really great goal Kimmich, good looking move this, well there's a keeper on song, well how did he stop that, that's just unbelievable, Kimmich, well the attack fizzled out, it opens up for Havertz, and saved by the keeper. Joshua Kimmich with the corner. And clears his lines. Effective challenge. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. McGinn. Doughty defending to win the ball back. This attack looks highly promising. He's in with a chance. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.